An incredible show of support today for a group of women packing up and heading to Poland. They're setting out to help women refugees struggling to make it on their own after escaping Ukraine. Now some have children of their own, so now they're on a mission for other moms, bringing them life-saving supplies and spiritual support. A powerful and sobering message this week, 109 empty strollers and baby seats set out in the western Ukraine city of Lviv, a stark reminder of the 109 children killed since Russia's invasion began. Families grieving, many struggling to survive. I have a huge heart for the moms that are pregnant and just gave birth and with newborns. Natalia Sechuk started up a women's ministry at Spring of Life Ukrainian Baptist Church in Orangevale, where several of them are now planning a trip to Poland to help women refugees and their children. Your heart just breaks for this. It's too much, go it's just too painful to watch. So all of us are trying to help out with everything that we can possibly help out. The church held a massive bake sale Sunday. Sunday with piles of Slavic goods raising money for the ministry's trip as some will fly out this week. We didn't have even reached the second service. Everything's already almost sold out. Like the hearts of people is just it's amazing to watch. It's been amazing. The people are so generous. Most of them are coming up with like 20s, 100s, like no change needed and just donating for the cause. So it's been great. Natalia has friends and family in Ukraine sending her pictures of refugees, women and children crammed into rooms needing food, clothes, medicine, making their mission clear and critical. We send them over there so they can work with ladies and kids to mentally and spiritually support our people. Our main mission is to get God across. We want people to come in and feel the love of God in Christ and to reach out to as many hearts as we possibly can. Yeah, we'll be thinking of them on that trip. The women's ministry called Mama's Nest has already been working with pastors in Poland so they know what's needed and they're hoping to then expand their ministry to Poland. Once they get there, they'll start flying out as early as tomorrow.